Morocco. The 2022 World Cup semifinalists bowed out of the 2023 Africa Cup of Nations courtesy of a 2-0 defeat by South Africa in the quarterfinal on Tuesday. Even though Bafana Bafana managed to beat Morocco in one of their two meetings in the qualification stage of the tournament last year, punters had Morocco as the favorites in the clash. But according to the South Africa manager Hugo Bruce remarks in the pre-match day press conference on Monday, the fact that the Atlas Lions team boasts of great players who play for big clubs in Europe did not guarantee them a win in every game. And true to his word, Bruce selected eight South African league-based players in his starting 11 for the clash with the goalkeeper, and the whole defense line being teammates from Mamelodi Sundowns. Facing a Morocco team missing two of their best midfielders in Hakim Zayek and Sofiane Bouffal, Bafana Bafana took the challenge heads-on. After a KG first half, they broke the deadlock in the 57th minute when Evidence Makopa beat the offside trap before drilling a low-finish pass Yassine Buno. Morocco got a golden opportunity in the 84th minute to equalize from the spot, but Ashraf Hakimi strike bounced off the crossbar. The North Africans were then reduced to 10 men following Sofian Amrabat's red card in stoppage time before Tebo Mokona fired the resulting free kick into the near post. Beating a team like Morocco is something special. They are a good team, but we did the right analysis and our tactic was the right one, said Hugo Bruce. Today I failed, so we have to accept it, said Morocco boss Walid Rigrangli after the game.